Established in the year 2016-17, Triple IT Pune has received a rating of 3.9 on Chiksha.com. How is Triple IT Pune for BTEC? Let's find out in this detailed college review. Starting right off with the placements, which have been rated 4.3 stars by students on Chiksha.com. The placement cycle for the batch passing out in 2024 is still ongoing, and the institute has released tentative numbers for these. Prominent recruiters include Amazon, Adobe, Microsoft, Nvidia, JP Morgan, IBM, to name a few. So far, 54 out of 218 students who have registered for placements have been rolled out offers. The overall placement rate so far stands at 25%. The highest package has reached a figure of 43 lakhs, whereas the average is around 13.25 lakhs for the ongoing cycle. Last year, which is for the batch graduating in 2022-23, the highest package was 54 lakh per annum with Amazon, which was an off-campus placement. The highest on-campus placement was for 53 lakh per annum with Yugabyte. Taking a look at the year-on-year -year numbers for average packages, one can see that there has been a 12% improvement in the last two years. Although in the last year itself, there has been a dip. Comparing these to Triple IT Pune's contemporaries located in Varodhra and Nagpur, one can see that students in Triple IT Pune are walking off with better salaries. Moving to internships, according to the official data, the highest stipend offered to 67 eligible students for both the CSE and ECE batches were 1 lakh and 75,000 respectively for the year 2023 24. Students have stated that they get internship opportunities in the 6th and 7th semesters. However, some also secured internships in the 4th and 5th semesters. Roles of testers, software and web developers were offered during internships by some top companies like Goldman Sachs, Grow, IBM, Infosys, Google and Amazon. Some students claim that international internships were also offered. Triple IT Pune offers BTEC with two specializations in CSE and ECE with a combined intake of around 345 seats. Out of these, two-thirds are for CSE only. Admissions are given based on JEE main ranks and the eligibility is a minimum 75% score in 10 plus 2. A quick look at the JEE main closing cutoffs in 2023-24 reveals that ranks have gone down leading to easier competition for securing admissions to both CSE and ECE in 2023 compared to the last two years. Comparing the closing cutoff ranks with neighbouring Triple IT Nagpur, one can see that it is easier to secure admissions to Triple IT Nagpur as compared to Pune. The total tuition fee at Triple IT Pune stands at approximately 9.85 lakhs for four years. The hostel fees is over 3 lakhs for four years, taking the total fees to around 13 lakhs for BTEC. With this fee structure and the average salary expectancy, the institute's yearly ROI appears to level out. Incidentally, students have given a 3.6 star rating for value for money to Triple IT Pune. Let's switch gears to the 3.7 star rated infrastructure and see what students are saying. Currently, Triple IT Pune is operating from its temporary campus at Sinagar College. Students are hopeful that the college will move to its permanent campus by January 2025, but no official date has been announced yet. As per reports, the 100 acre permanent campus is being constructed in Naloni, Talegao, Pune. The permanent campus will include academic blocks, two boys' hostels, one girl's hostel and other service blocks. The construction for the academic block is 45% complete. Talking about the temporary campus in Sinagar College Complex, students stated that the classrooms have a seating capacity of over 125 students and labs are in a good condition. Students further stated that the hostel facilities are good, although expensive. Meanwhile, many students expressed discontentment over the quality of mess food. Due to the transitionary status, students have complained about the lack of proper sports facilities or adequate grounds. Shifting gears to the faculty and course curriculum, which has received 4.1 stars from students. The faculty consists of mostly PhDs. Teachers are supportive and spend extra hours clarifying the doubts that students may have. The curriculum is relevant and makes the student industry ready, resulting in robust employment opportunities, especially given Pune's status as an IT hub of sorts. Interestingly, studious candidates securing more than 8 CGPA have the option of pursuing specializations such as AI, ML, data science and robotics. Students also share that exams are held monthly and the level of difficulty is set to be moderate. Meanwhile, talking about the 3.8 rated campus life, according to the college website, Triple IT Pune organizes various events to promote and encourage students and their extracurricular talents. The campus has a vibrant atmosphere despite limited resources. Annual events such as cultural fests, technical conclaves and sports summits are held. Moreover, extracurricular activities such as sports and arts are encouraged. However, some were disappointed by the campus life again due to the temporary status of this campus. 
Finally, the NIRF rankings where Triple IT Pune is yet to enter the big league of colleges that have an NIRF ranking attached to their names. For more details on Triple IT Pune and to check out thousands of course and college reviews, visit shiksha.com. We'd like to hear from you, so do drop in a comment below and do not forget to like and share this video.